How's it going everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today we are finally back out here on this nice little creek doing some fishing today. There's a number of different species that live in this little creek so there's really no telling what we are going to catch. We also had a bit of rain last night so we'll see how that affects the fishing. Without further ado, let's jump right to the video and I hope you all enjoy. All right, so today we're actually going to be using our little micro rod right here. We're going to start off throwing a little crick hopper. I've actually probably not used a crick hopper in almost a year. But I was going through some of my tackle the other day and I found one. They're a great little bait to imitate little bugs or minnows in the water. So let's see if it'll catch us anything today. All right, here we go, you guys. First cast of the day. Let's try to catch some fish now. Oh, I just got bit. No way, you guys. First cast of the day. I just had a bite. I think it was just a little bluegill, but it's a pretty good sign. All right, so at this spot, I'm getting a ton of bites from a bunch of little sunfish, but they're not really committing to my little crick hopper. So I think I'm gonna try to move a bit further upstream to try to find some more fish there. Oh, there's a fish, you guys, there we go. There's number one of the day right there on the crick hopper too. Oh my gosh, look at that, you guys. That's a really nice size crick chub right there. I absolutely hammered that little crick hopper. That is awesome. This guy put up a really good fight. I thought he was a bass or something when I was bringing him in. That is really cool. That is awesome right there, you guys. Great start to the day right there. Nice size crick chub on the crick hopper. Let's get him right back in the water now. Well, that was very cool, you guys. That was our first fish of the day. Absolutely hammered that little crick hopper. Put up a great fight, too. Let's get it right back in there and see what else we can catch now. Oh, there's a fish. There we go, you guys. There's another one right there. Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh, holy cow, you guys. We just caught a little largemouth bass. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, check that out, you guys. There's a little largey right there on the crick hopper. Not very big, but that's pretty much what you'd expect out of a little creek like this. That is so cool. This is actually one of the first bass that I've ever caught in this little creek. That is so cool, you guys. Nice little fish right there. And there he goes. That was awesome. Let's get it right back in there and see what else we can catch now. Well, that was a bit of a surprise catch, you guys. I don't normally catch bass in this little creek, and I got that little guy on the crick hopper, too. Okay, so we've been fishing with that little crick hopper for pretty much the whole time we have been out here. So I just switched up to this little curly tail grub right here on a jig head. This is also one of my favorite baits to catch pretty much anything, so we'll see what we can catch with this. Oh, there we go. There's a fish, you guys. No way. First cast with that little curly tail grub. Holy cow. Look at that. That is a really nice size common shiner right there, you guys. Look at that. Look at that really nice size common shiner right there. Little curly tail grub pegged him right in the top of the mouth. That is awesome. Well, that's pretty cool, you guys. That is our third fish of the day and our third species of the day. Let's get him right back in the water. And there he goes. All right, so I'm getting a lot more bites on this little curly tail grub than I was on the crick hopper. So I think I'm going to go back to that first spot that we started fishing at to try to catch some of those sunfish. Yeah, earlier today at this spot with that little crick hopper, a ton of these little sunfish were very interested in it, but they weren't really committing to it, so I have no doubt in my mind that they'll go for this little curly tail right here. Oh, there we go. That was fast, you guys. Holy cow, look at that. Look at that, you guys. First cast at this spot with that little curly tail grub. Just let it slowly fall to the bottom, and this little bluegill picked it up. That's awesome. It's also our fourth species of the day. Nice little bluegill right there on the little curly tail. And there he goes. Oh, there we go. There's a fish, you guys. Ooh, what is this? Oh my gosh, you guys. What is this? It's fighting really hard. Oh my gosh, look at the size of that creek chub right there, you guys. That has got to be one of the biggest creek chubs I have ever caught. He's not very long, but look at the belly on him. That's a really nice size fish right there. Put up an insane fight, too. That's crazy, you guys. This guy's definitely been eating a lot. That's probably our biggest fish of the day right there. Nice size creek chub. And he's back. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. That's a fish. Oh, no way, guys. A little green sunfish right there. That is also a new species for today. Look at that, you guys. A little green sunfish right there. Definitely not a big one at all, but that is a new species for today. Today's turning out to be actually a really good day of multi-species fishing. I believe that this is our fifth species of the day. That is really cool. How I'm fishing this little curly tail grub today, you guys, is I'm just casting it out there. I'm letting it slowly fall to the bottom, and once it reaches the bottom, I lift it back up and let it slowly fall again, and on the fall is when the fish normally hit it. Oh, there we go. There's another one right there. Oh my gosh, what is this? It's putting up a really nice fight. Oh, holy cow, you guys. Look at the size of that green sunfish right there. That is awesome. That is a really nice sized green sunfish for this creek. This is probably one of the biggest ones that I've ever caught out of here. That is awesome. That is awesome right there, you guys. Beautiful sunfish. I love the colors on these little guys. Put up a great fight on that little micro rod, too. And see you later, buddy. Oh, there we go. There's a fish, you guys. Oh my gosh, look at that. Another really nice sized green sunfish right there. This guy looks to be a little bit smaller than that last one, but still a really nice fish for this creek. Another beautiful sunfish right there. See you later, buddy, and have a great day. Well, anyways, that just about wraps it up for today's video out here fishing on this creek. I would say that we had a pretty successful day of fishing. We were able to catch a number of different species, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to stay tuned for more, and I will see you all in the next video.